a look at this manifold up close and personal here. That's all the spaghetti tubes going out of every one of those manifolds there. Well, I hope you're not afraid of heights because today I'm hands-free and I'm climbing this tree to install more of these tubes. The last time I was out here, I used the staple gun to try to staple the tubes to the tree and I ended up stapling through the tube because that's not exactly the right staple gun for what I was doing. So I had an epiphany this morning. What I'm going to start doing is I'm going to cut these little two inch sections of the tube and then I'm going to fold it around the tube and staple one staple through that section that I cut out. I don't care if the staple goes through that section because it's not going through the tube carrying the water. So that was this morning's epiphany. I got to get set up again here so I can start running more tubes through the tree because as you can see we've got a lot of points to bring those tubes to. I mean, we've got orchids all over the place. There will be more here. You can see the old tube there. As I bring the new one in, I'm gonna take that one out. I'll hide the other tube behind there somewhere so you can't see it as easily. And I've got all of this to do and all of that to do. And back here, can't forget these guys. Gotta run tubes all the way through the tree down to these. It's gonna be a tree climbing day. And I brought the right camera with me today for this. So, like I said at the beginning, hope you're not afraid of heights, because we're going up. Alright, now the fun part. Climb the van. Unfortunately, the camera stopped right at that point. I was filming myself climbing throughout the tree, but I didn't capture it, so I'm sorry. Definitely climb the tree, though, because those sprinklers didn't get up there on their own. Alright, on with the rest of the video. Alright, so I've been at it for the last couple of hours, climbing all over the front of this tree. It's gonna be kind of hard to see in this view, but I've got one right there, one right there, one right there. Similar on this side, I've got three going up the side there. There's one in that hole of the tree, old tree branch there. There's a few in here. And we've got one over this guy here. One up there, one over here. I need to get water to those two right here. So we're gonna get started by pulling out some more of the tubing from in here. There we go, pull from the middle, makes it easier. And I'm gonna have to climb up to, I'm gonna bring this tube up through the same way I've been bringing the rest of them up, and I need to get in through there. So the way I've been doing this is just running out some tube because it'll get all coiled up like that and then I wanna make it nice and straight. I'm gonna go underneath here, through all of these branches here, like I've been doing with all the other hoses here. Let me get that going up. All right, that's probably enough hose there. And then keep fishing it through just to make sure that we don't knot it up anywhere. This this is very tedious work. I mean, going through and making sure it doesn't overlap across with other tubes to make it look as clean as I can. This is going to still be a uh, a lot of tubes going around this whole tree, but we'll get there. So now that I got through there, we'll go ahead and run them through these little areas here. Pull all of our slack, make sure we don't have any of this going on. All right, now that we got all that through, we got it up to a point where now we're gonna have to start climbing the tree. I'll probably bring this hose in through there and then around to the other side over there. So let's grab the rest of this hose and we'll throw it up into that spot where I need to climb up to. Good enough. The hose is staying there. Guys, it's really freaking hot out here, so I'm probably not gonna film putting the rest of these up in the tree. What I will film is once I get this done, I'll turn it on and we'll take a look at what all that looks like. That'll be the next clip. But for the next four or five hours, I'm gonna climb all over this tree and get the rest of these spaghetti tubes on the tree. It's a little aggravating because it's super humid out today and we've got a heat index of 112 degrees in South Florida, so I'm, I'm fighting it, but I'm gonna get it done. And there she is, all spaghetti tubed up. Let's take a look at this manifold up close and personal here. That's all the spaghetti tubes going out of every one of those manifolds there. There are 32 tubes coming out of that manifold, and they're going all over this tree, starting with right here in the front. We've got these sprayers going up here. We've got some dripper sprayers, call them what you want, going up there. We've got dripper sprayers in this whole section here. I mean, we can just keep going around this whole tree. I've got drippers all over the place. I got some on this, I've got some on these, I've got some over here, some in there. I'm getting rained on because I've got some up there, like way up there. I mean, we're, we're looking beautiful now. The orchids are getting watered. Awesome. All right, on to the next one.